Can't one shot these guys anymore? What the hell happened? No, your vessel cannot turn. That is not allowed. Nice! You know, he's not nearly as bad as I had thought. He does have some useful useful abilities for dealing with multiple enemies. Um, still like the other the other one better. But Templar's starting to hold his own. He's not doing it in terms of damage, but the abilities are really what you want with the follower. Um, I remember when I was at Bruton, I did ask, uh, somebody asked if they were going to let you have a build that was built around your follower. Uh, kind of like a pal my paladin in, uh, in Diablo 2, but they wanted it more so that way. I was told that it was a paladin, but I just didn't build it right in order to get the follower super powerful. And they pretty much said... They said they didn't see why not, but I really don't see that happening. And I am not going to be sprinting. Ooh, passive. Unless you open up another... Another way... Another, like, slot for me, I probably won't be doing that. See, it still doesn't hit him after he stands up. That's the point. It's really just for, like, walking. Not for damage dealing, as far as I can tell. Did I pick up anything crappy? No. I didn't pick up anything that great either. Skills, let's take a look at them. So I can do sprint instead of ground stomp um, so that I could run furiously for f three seconds. <laughs> yes, totally want to do that. Weapons Master! Um, wow, that's actually pretty good. Uh, that Let's see, I got an axe, so 10% critical damage. And scythe, I don't see anything there. So I probably wouldn't get anything for the scythe. Unless that falls into the pole arms or mighty weapons category. Either, either way, I'm going to stick with armor. Because I do have... How much vitality? 47. I mean, that'll, that'll drastically increase as we go through the game. I mean, it goes... Everything in this game increases exponentially. Just to let you know, at this point in the game in Nightmare, I'm doing over four to 500 damage. Uh, with my skills, and I'm still not killing things and struggling more than I am here. So things definitely change. Like I said, it's got that curve where you just constantly need to get loot. This is a loot fest after all. It's well, it's Diablo. That's what it's built on. Oh shit! Stud. Ah. I can't do the hammer. Oh, now I can do the hammer. So, 181 damage on a critical on the hammer. I don't know if you guys saw that. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> they keep on morphing on me. Do I have lessers equipped? I don't. I still have the miners equipped. I will see because there definitely comes a point in when I'm playing that. I'll have more of the upgraded potions than the, than the lower grade potions, and that's usually when I make the switch over. Uh, yeah, let's just keep going down. Oh shit, here we go! A command from the cultist Grand Inquisitor. Didn't we already kill that guy? I need more bodies. You think my summoners can just conjure up a demon whenever it pleases them? We must have blood. Fresh blood, mind you. And human flesh to bolster our magic. I will be expecting a reply from you shortly. Sounds lovely. He needs more, more blood for his blood magic. Uh, I'm not supposed to call it blood magic, but... No idea how I relate the games I'm playing together. We're gonna go this way. And another lectern. Of all the abominable stalling! In case it was not clear, I need the sacrifices now! I've heard enough of your idle complaints that the villagers have fled from the highlands, leaving no one left to sacrifice. You'd best come up with something, or it's your hide will be flaying. Flaying. Huh. Oh, Sometimes I, I don't hear him correctly. Okay, so looks like that means we are out of... Yeah, I'm fine. We'll keep going. Looks like I am out of... 
notes or whatever you want to call it, the little reading things for this dungeon because they did give me an abundance of uh, places where they could spawn. They usually do that. They'll give you, even though there's only five, they'll give you six spots By where you can be. Holy, do you see that enemy over there? Yes, but it's Vortex. We'll wait for that to go away, and then I can pick up all the gold, and then pick that up. So, you might notice that the gold that I'm picking up is not very much, right? You know, we're going five, six, all that kind of stuff. And overall, maybe after a normal run, that I'd probably get a total of around 50,000, maybe 100,000. And you saw that I had 170, and that I was doing that. Like I said, I I I did finally make it to Act Two in Nightmare. That's where I am in that run. So definitely, even the money escalates tremendously uh, to the point where items, well, in the auction house I have seen sell for millions of gold. So millions is apparently pretty easy to come by. Whereas here, normally I would probably have around ten thousand. I would think somewhere around there. Again, it's hard to say because my money transfers between characters. And one of the reasons I don't like that. Looks like we need to go out there, but first I'm going to go down here. What the hell's going on down here? This place is a slaughterhouse. Uh, lots of dead villagers around. Lots of torture barrels. This is this is pretty damn ugly. Oh shit! There was like a barrel of blood. You want to see it explode? Go! No, there wasn't. There was like a body in there. Why more blood? Go guillotine! I don't get anything for setting off the guillotine. I haven't gotten anything good yet. Why would I even come down here? Gold? Gold means nothing to me anymore. I'll take what I can get. Dead villager, dead villager, torture barrels, done, and yeah, this guy. That's the key event, right? That will spawn everybody else. But I'm still disappointed. I'm probably not going to get anything that great out of this. So I just left. So I'm getting this gold. If I didn't do this, I would have just been asking what if the entire time. We can't have that happen. Oh shit, I missed that guy. He didn't have anything anyway. Okay, let's head out of here. So if this isn't it, then we're not nearly as far in the act as I thought we were. This, this first act does go, go on for quite a bit. It's probably the longest act. I have not measured it out myself, but this is probably the longest act. Enter the cursed hold now, it looks like. So we're going to take on more children. We're going to take on more cultists. We're going to be seeing those throughout. Uh, Magda is the head of the cult. I don't know if that's become quite apparent. That's why we are fighting so many cultists. Magda's in charge of that. Magda's, Magda's not so very nice. She's taking the stranger hostage. Don't know why. What the hell does she want to do with this stranger? Go. Yes, grab all that. Grab all that. Jeez, just a ton of gold. I'd rather have items, to be honest with you. Give me items. Stop dropping gold. Highlands Passage. Not that, not that long. As you might expect, it's just a passage. Give me that. I think I am starting to, to have more of the lessers than the miners. How many do I have? 27. Close. Once we get there though, that's usually the point at which I change. I could easily change now. How much does a seal? 250 and I've got 570. How are you doing, Queen Asilla? I am Asilla, once queen to our beloved Leoric. My servants and I were consumed by his madness. Doesn't sound good. Now I give you my blessing, champion, to release my people from their eternal torment.
Now we need to free the prisoners. Uh, there's her chest with her journal. Starved of the sun, I no longer know what day it is. I can hear the warden, my husband, and that dog Lazarus discussing my fate. My life will be over soon, yet I fear more for my poor Albrecht's future in the wake of his father's madness. If only Aiden were here. So it looks like Leoric had three sons. Albrecht, Lazarus. Wait, Lazarus? Is Lazarus a son? Uh, I get confused. Albrecht and Aiden definitely are. Anything more to say? No. That is it. Now we are in this giant... I guess you could say official dungeon because this is more like a jail cell. The other place was, was where people were being tortured. So, I don't know. Which one's more of a dungeon? This one's... That one was just like a place where people got tortured. This is where they were actually held. Dungeon can apply to really either one. Even horror. Ah, get back here. Torturing someone needs to die. Then I can kill you guys, no problem. Ah, you dropped more gold. There's gold over there. I will pick it up even though I would much prefer items that I can equip. Uh, there, ah. It does hurt you. It's not very much. But it definitely hurts you when you stand in that circle and he explodes. Not very much. Of course, I got the heels going on at all time. That again. Yeah, because you didn't do shit. Get the jailer's bones. These guys die. Like, on the job? That's dedicated to the end, let me tell you. You can't even open the door? Actually, good thing you don't. Uh, Diablo 2, they would do that all the time, and it would mess me up. A mighty adversary is before us. Actually, there's a few adversaries there. Are they smart enough to figure out how to get to me? They are! Somewhat. Teleporter. They don't like teleporters, so I stun them. There we go. I'm sure we could. I'm going to try to go around the outside here. This place is not really that random. I don't think it's random. I think the enemies are random, but the actual layout is the same. So, I know the layout already. And I need to get the summoner. How you doing, Templar? You know, Templar is... He can hold his own. God. Swing and a miss. You can still hear that going. Oh, I love it. There's no way I can... Oh, shit. Treasure bandit. I think I figured out once how to zoom in. I'll try to do that next time one of those shields goes spinning. Oh, you better not leave me to attack, man. There we go. There he goes. High breaches and a morning star. Morning star would be good. Yeah. There we go. Can I how do I zoom in? Yeah, I've forgotten. I am free. Okay, that's all he says, but we, we freed him. They'll show up on your map. I think I still need to explore over here. Just completely ignored it due to that treasure bandit. Worth it, though. Definitely worth it. I still love being this overpowered, but that's because I know how that changes. And if you don't know how that changes, you might not like it as much. But I know. It will not stay like this. It will not stay to the point where I one-shot everything. It might be... Still pretty easy at the end of normal, but that's to be expected. What do we have in... Where's the door to this one? Did I miss the door? Oh, it's like... Water barrel! There we go. Here it is. Are these guys with the shield? They're not so nice, because they block. When they block, I don't kill them in one shot. Is there... God, nothing in there. Did I clear out all of them? There's usually the, the six cells, right? One, two, three, four. Oh, I didn't clear that one. The way, of course, the way ends on the complete opposite side. How did I ignore that? 
Ran right past it. Not sure if this is the long way or the short way, but this is the way that I went. Open the door! I hit him through the door! That was awesome! Die. Oh, he was out of range, otherwise he would have died too. Water barrel! Die, water! Wa you are free now! Let's just head over here and... Eh, we'll go down to the bottom. You could go through the middle. I don't think there's going to be much there. Plus, we'll have to go there eventually. I'll head to the bottom. Go water! Oh shit. Why was there an executioner in the water? I don't think those globes stay very long, so that's why I always pick them up. Here's a door and obviously a path for us to go down, but we can't head that way just yet. Get the horror. Oh shit, there was a big enemy over there. I saw that. Yeah. Oh, 61 damage, but because I stayed in there. Oh, he dropped a pot, so I'm good. Oh, a jailer? Fine. Hammer. 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 Get that heater shield, and we will move on again. Or we'll go up here, because there's... Savage beans, not that scary. Okay, now we're up here. Where are these entrances? And now, yeah, there are going to be a ton of prisoners over here because they weren't on the other side. Law of averages. It works for me sometimes. Except when I have money on the line, then it never works for me. Freedom after so long. Freedom. Nothing? What? Who cares? There it is. Thank the gods. I said I just did this so I do know when that happens. Looks like there was somebody not too happy with what I have done. We'll probably have to fight that guy eventually. They, the Diablo's not not a game to tease you or something. It's just like if there's a big bad enemy. Oh yeah, you're gonna fight it. <laughs> they ran all that way, and I'm just uh, whatever. Die. Oh shit, the Templar got a kill. Nicely done. Yeah, I bet it was. You finally got that kill. I am free. My gods, there is someone amongst us. Deal with him harshly. I don't know if that actually spawns anything. He's told his guards to deal with us. It must be like a... I don't know, the warden? Something like that? There's number five, and hopefully we can find the entrance to number six. There it is. Let's kill everybody before we deal with that. So that number six does something as well. Oh, shit, Almost killed everybody with that hit. Pick that up. You can die. Once again, I'll, I'll fully explore this place. Kill, kill everybody. Make sure that happens. Because it sounds like this guy is not so nice. And there's an entrance down the bottom. What's up? Make it a lot easier to get back there. Okay, head this way, and then we can free the prisoner. Destroy the bones for 23 gold. Okay, now back inside. Let the last one go. Freedom after so long. Thank you, champion. My servants are now free, but the curse over this place remains. Seek the warden at the dungeon center and end his evil forever. So now it's time to take on the warden. Just like I thought. Pretty generic name. God, how do I get out? Okay, this way. This one's like a maze. Who designs a, a jail like this? I mean, it's not that bad. Not nearly as bad as the dungeon designs in, in Diablo 2 where you're like, what the fuck is this supposed to be? A harem? How's this a harem? But, a little strange. Am I alone here? No. Must I do this myself? So be it. Face me. Oh! We've got the warden. What am I doing? Hammers. Hammers to victory. 
Uh, you, I don't know how much you did. I'll be honest, that was mostly me. The warden bow. Is that even good? Is that a special? Like, the, did he drop that? Or did the, the thing drop that? I think. Yeah, that's not special at all. Alright, so we got quite a few things, and now we can head out. I don't think there's anything on any of these paths. It all just appears in the middle. Two gold! So worth it. Let's head down here. And that has opened up the gates. Is there anything? Yeah, there's usually at least one or two things hiding back here. Don't miss them. Oh, shit. That's not the way I wanted to go. I want to check over here first, because the door is down there. Not just the one thing. No, it's kind of disappointing. Usually there's more. Into the Chamber of Suffering. Oh, shit. The ancient smile on you. That, that, and go in here. My lord, the prisoner is ready as you requested. Thank you, Lazarus. Your loyalty is invaluable in the midst of all these traitors. And you, my dear, my own wife and queen, conspiring against our kingdom. My love, I swear, I have never betrayed you. Lies until the very end. A grim end to a noble woman. I am proud to have played my part in Leoric's fall. You haven't done anything, Templar. The time of my lord's true awakening is at hand. That fool Leoric was only able to resist him because he did not yet possess his full power. With the Queen dispatched as a traitor, I may now devote myself fully to preparing the boy for the presence of my master. That's right, Lazarus is the Archbishop that was doing the the summoning thing with Albrecht in the basement. Creepy ass dude, that guy.